You're listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional. Today's topic, David, You Are the Man, Part 1. At 25 years old, Stan Larkin lived for 555 days with a completely artificial heart while awaiting a donor transplant. His artificial device, called a syncardia, even allowed Larkin to play basketball. But while an amazing feat of modern medicine, the syncardia could never replace a real heart especially the new heart that God desires to give each one of us. David was a man who desired a heart like God. As a youth, he loved the Lord and wanted to do his will. For this, he was chosen by God to replace Saul as king of Israel and was anointed by the prophet Samuel when only a boy, 1 Samuel 16, 13. But David's ascent to the throne was not an easy road. His victories, starting with his defeat of Goliath, the Philistine giant, always seemed paired with great afflictions. One day, esteemed by King Saul, his son-in-law even, and the next day he became a hunted fugitive. Though beloved by the people, he was persecuted by the king, separated from his family, his best friend, and his wife. But it was because of these hardships that David leaned so much upon the will of God. He had nothing of his own, no home, no money. His only security was in God. While in rare times he showed flashes of impatience and vengeance, like during his encounter with Nabal, 1 Samuel 25, 12, and 13, or fear and distrust, like when he defected to the Philistines, chapter 27, 1, David primarily put his trust in God, and when he did so, he flourished. Habitually asking the Lord's counsel in battle, David gained multiple victories against Israel's enemies, yielding to God as the only righteous judge, he mercifully spared Saul's life twice over chapter 24, verses 4 through 7, and chapter 26, verses 7 through 12. Faithfully waiting for years, at the age of 30, David was finally given the throne, 2 Samuel, chapter 5, and verse 4. His enemies nearly vanquished, his people unified, his kingdom prosperous, David finally settled into his long-awaited rule. Now, for the first time ever, he was at peace. He did not have to run, he did not have to fight, He was in need of nothing, so he thought, and in that moment David stepped away from God. Reflect. Are you a person after God's own heart? Do you want what God wants, or what you yourself want? Trust in God's ways, for they are better than your own. Our key Bible text today comes from 1 Samuel chapter 13 and verse 14. But now thy kingdom shall not continue. The Lord hath sought him, a man after his own heart and the Lord hath commanded him to be captain over his people, because thou hast not kept that which the Lord commanded thee. Thank you for listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional.